few, I've met a few people who are very much into yoga, yoga teachers. I, I just asked them, are you interested in enlightenment? And, and I, I, they did not particularly say they were just smiling, but I can see they have no interest. They have, they're, they're not aware of it. It's not important, so important. So, so then, then what, what, why are you doing yoga that many hours or in, intense? Well, you know, it's spiritual things to do. And it's, uh, it's good for your body, uh, good for your health, okay? Good for your body, good for your health, anything to do. Is that all? And for some people, many people, it is. That, that is all what it is. And it's fine, of course it's fine. It's better to do yoga than, you know, smoking, you know. <laughs> uh, but that's not enough. So they are not conscious. They are, they are not taught. There's two things. One is maybe they are not conscious, so the teachers need to, be, need, need to teach them. Second is they are not able to be aware. They are not ready to be aware. That's different. So if they are not ready to, uh, 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 they are not ready, then they are not ready. This life, enjoy yoga in that way. But if they are ready, if they didn't find somebody to teach them, that's a sad, sad gap. So in when people will come to me, I just want to make sure that I give all the options. <laughs> I don't know who's ready and who's not ready. I, I'm not one decision making decision maker in that way. But I give options. I just, I, I play around, I said, this here, this, 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 all this possibility, find your way and be happy with that. 